Kim Kardashian is defending her choice to wear Marilyn Monroe's dress to the 2022 Met Gala. During an interview with today's Hoda Kotb and Savannah Guthrie, Kim denies damaging the garment and reminds online critics that she worked closely with the Ripley's Believe It or Not Museum to prevent the iconic dress from being damaged. I mean, it was such a process. I had to change. I, I showed up to the red carpet in a robe and slippers, uh -huh. and I put the dress on on the bottom of the carpet. Oh, my gosh. Went up the stairs. I probably had it on for three minutes, four minutes. So, and then I changed right at the top of so the So all of the, con we keep seeing stuff like the dress is ruined, the dress is this. All of that is uh, is not mm, true. No. And I mean, Ripley's were yeah. so, we worked together yeah. so well. There was handlers and gloves yeah. that put it on me. Ripley's has said that the yeah. dress wasn't damaged. Yeah. Yeah. Kim's clapback comes after social media users claim that the dress appeared to be damaged after photos of the garment post Met Gala appearance were posted online. Ripley's Museum, who purchased the dress for $4.8 million in 2016, defended Kim by releasing a statement on June 16th that read, Kim Kardashian's walk up the Metropolitan Museum stairs at this year's Met Gala caused quite the stir. But one thing Ripley's Believe It or Not can say with confidence is that it did not cause damage to Marilyn Monroe's famed happy birthday dress from 1962. Additionally, Kim went into more detail on today and explains the reason she was so happy to wear the dress. We were yeah. just talking, you said you were shocked on TikTok. Some people didn't even know who Marilyn Monroe was. That was the most shocking thing to me. <laughs> and that's why I was so happy to at least have that opportunity and that Ripley's gave me the opportunity to, ex you know, share this moment mm -hmm. so that people, it could live on. I mean, I respect her. I understand how much this dress means to American mm -hmm. history. And with the theme being American, I thought, what is more... Mm -hmm. American than Marilyn Monroe singing happy birthday to the president of the United States. Yeah.